Hello everyone, it's Bill from Cambodia. Today I'm going to talk about being LGBT plus in Cambodia and whether or not it's safe, as well as talk about a few places you can hang out. So, why am I talking about this? Well, for one, I don't really see other people talking about it much, if at all, on the other channels that cover living and uh, moving to Cambodia. I happen to be pansexual. So that basically means I'm about hearts, not parts. Whatever a person's gender is, their gender identity, what they got between their legs, none of that is much of a factor or a deal breaker into whether or not I could be attracted to them. For me, it's about the kind of person they are. Is it safe to be open and out? The short answer is yes, it's quite safe. The more expanded answer is you don't really see the sort of hate crimes in Cambodia that you do in a lot of Western countries regarding that kind of thing. Like there may be some arguments between older and younger people, like not across the board, but the older, more conservative and stodgy folks who want people to be more reserved versus the more open and out and flamboyant younger folks. There's a lot of trans people in Cambodia, so you don't have to worry about that. Like I said, hate crimes are virtually non-existent, especially against foreigners. The one thing I will say is that public displays of affection, no matter who you are, gay, straight, trans, or whatever, public displays of affection are not really welcome in Cambodia. It's more still conservative and traditional, like holding hands, a peck on the cheek, that's fine, but hanging all over each other and making out and deep kissing and fondling in public, not the best thing to do. Just kind of be more respectful and demure about that kind of thing. Now, if you're in one of the bars and everyone's just being open and more flirty and stuff like that, that's different. So in short, you don't have to worry about your safety for being who you are. As far as places to hang out, uh, I know about some places in Siem Reap. I don't know much about what's in Phnom Penh or elsewhere. As far as the Siem Reap places, I also have them in the map down in the description. But I'll, I'll just give you a basic rundown of what's still around and what those kind of places are like. So we have Barcode, which is the biggest uh, club there. There's a lot of drag shows. It's very lively. It's slightly pricey. Um, and it's really busy. <laughs> and so, you know, it's just a more flamboyant, outgoing kind of place. If you're really into the kind of party club culture, then that's that kind of place. There's Up To Me Pub, Up, and then the number two, and then me. That's pretty much catering to a younger crowd mostly. And it's a friendly little place. Not a bad place to hang out, especially for the younger folks. Rendezvous Bar is kind of a melting pot. There's all kinds of people. It's kind of primarily towards older crowd and gay men and some trans people. And it's really friendly, fairly busy. And it's just kind of the cool hangout melting pot for kind of everyone in uh, Siem Reap who leans LGBT+. There's a newer place called Bee Ball, and it's a smaller place. It's got a pool table. It's got a karaoke. It's pretty friendly. Uh, it's a cool little place. A little bit hard to find, but it's on Google Maps. It shouldn't be too hard. There's a place called God Club. It's uh, pretty much drag shows and trans folks, a lot of dancing. It's definitely more of a club than a pub. Miss Wong is a kind of upscale, fancy, classy cocktail bar. That's basically that. It kind of caters to the LGBT plus crowd, and it's a great place for some tasty cocktails. There's a place called The Laundry. It's not specifically LGBT plus, but it is friendly. It's kind of a mixed crowd place with live music and things like that. So feel free to go to Cambodia. Be open, be yourself, but be reserved and respectful in public. Don't, don't worry about getting attacked. There. It's a lot, lot safer in Cambodia for you. Definitely more so than in the States. <laughs> By leaps and bounds. Feel free to uh, visit or live in Cambodia and be yourself. Take care. Bye-bye.